After days of fierce fighting, new hope for a truce between Georgia and Russia. Appearing at a press conference with French President Nicolas Sarkozy, Georgian President Mikhail Saakashvili said he had agreed to a modified version of a peace plan with Russia over the breakaway region of South Ossetia. Sarkozy arrived in Georgia after talks with Russian President Dmitry Medvedev. It's therefore the beginning of a process which allows France to hope with all its energy for peace in this region which we are in. First principle, the passage of an enforced line of separation between the different protagonists. Sarkozy said the text would be presented at a meeting of European Union ministers Wednesday. With their support, it would then provide the basis for a UN Security Council resolution. Saakashvili said he hoped the agreement was the preclude for moving international peacekeepers to South Ossetia. I think there are several things. Internationalization of the process, territorial integrity and sovereignty of Georgia without any reservations. This is very important for us. We can never compromise on that because I think the whole war will start to compromise, to undermine that. And we have a great understanding on return of refugees. And Despite assurances from both Georgia and Russia late Tuesday, U.S. officials could not confirm fighting had stopped. Russia said 1,600 civilians had been killed in the conflict and thousands left homeless. Those figures could not be confirmed. Georgia has reported almost 200 dead and hundreds wounded.